Everybody knows you can ice your cookies with the royal icing, but you also ice your cookies with the chocolate. There are several ways how you can melt chocolate. I prefer Wilton Candy Melt Pot. I created this particular cookies for my daughter's 9th birthday. It was immediate hit. Mix together semi-sweet chocolate chips, coconut oil, and set your pot to the high temperature. Continue mixing until done when it's all melted and smooth. Next, transfer your melted chocolate into the piping bag. I like to use thinner piping bags, the same one that I'm using for the roll icing. Divide your melted chocolate between two piping bags. One bag you're going to use to create the edges, and second bag you're going to use to flood the cookies. Twist your end of the piping bag and tie it in a knot. Take first bag and cut about 1 16th of an inch from the end. You always can cut more. I like to start by cutting a very tiny piece. This bag you're going to use for the edges. By gently squeezing the bag, start creating the edges on your sugar cookies. Next, take a second bag and cut a little bit more opening. This bag you're going to use for flooding. Flood your cookies and gently tap the cookies on the table to even the icing. Use your needle tool to help even the chocolate. It's take about 30 minutes to dry chocolate icing. 